And welcome into Pure Journal and Sports, everybody. This is John coming at you with live play-by-play -play and live reaction of the Mets and Reds game tonight. Mets are one and five on the year. Reds are four and two. So we'll see how things go tonight. We'll get into tonight's lineups. We'll take a look at the schedule around baseball as well. Orioles bird watcher right now doing the Orioles and Pirates game. Uh, looks like the bottom of the ninth there. Orioles with a five to two lead. This game is on Apple TV tonight. So MLB scores uh, tonight. Let's see games that are currently active. Uh, the Rockies lead the Rays four to two in the bottom of the eighth. Like I said, the Orioles lead the Pirates five to two. Uh, now with one out in the bottom of the ninth, Padres and Giants are tied at two. Uh, that game going to the bottom of the eighth. Uh, at 6.45, we got the Phillies and the Nationals coming up. 7.20, the Diamondbacks and Braves. 7.40, White Sox and Royals. 8.05, Astros and Rangers. Mariners and Brewers at 8.10. Uh, Red Sox and Angels at 9.38 tonight. I believe uh, Thomas Fitzpatrick will be, in, will be doing that game over on his channel tonight. Uh, the Blue Jays uh, beat the Yankees today, three nothing. Uh, they moved to four and four in the year. The Yankees uh, now six and two. The Tigers beat the A's. Tigers now six and one. Their only loss was that uh, Met game yesterday. Uh, the Mets get the walk off win in the bottom of the ninth. Uh, A's are one and seven on the year. And Cubs beat the Dodgers uh, nine to seven. Uh, Cubs are now five and two on the year, and the Dodgers are seven and three. All right, we got five likes on the stream already. We got a couple, we got a vote in the poll already. One vote for the Mets tonight so far. So good stuff. Let's look at tonight's lineups. The Mets lineup, Lindor will lead off tonight. Uh, that's a switch there. Alonzo will bat second. Uh, so those two guys both move up one spot in the lineup. Alvarez will bat third. Beatty will bat fourth. Marte, fifth. Tyrone Taylor, sixth. Jeff McNeil, uh, seventh. Harrison Bader, eighth. And DJ Stewart will DH and bat ninth. And the Reds' defense tonight, it'll be es uh, Espanol at third base. De La Cruz at short. India at second. And Carnacion Strand at first base. Luke Maley uh, doing the catching tonight. And the outfield from left to right, it's steer and left. Fairchild in center, and Will Benson in right field. The pitching matchup tonight, it'll be Jose Quintana for the Mets, making his second start of the year, and Hunter Green uh, for the Reds, also making his second start. Both pitchers uh, went four and two-third innings in their first outing. Uh, Quintana gave up a home run, walked two batters, and struck out four. Green didn't give up any homers, but walked four batters and struck out seven. So we'll see how they feel. Then we'll see how they uh, fare tonight. Hey, darkness is here. What's up, darkness? Are you still doing the flyer game at seven? Oh, there he goes. My first stream starts in twenty minutes. I'll have you on in the background, bud, giving you some support. Keep an eye on Steve here. It's five to two, bottom of the ninth. Uh, Orioles have that lead. Orioles looking to improve to five and two on the year. Darkness says, "Thanks, man. Appreciate it. Absolutely, man. For all the support you've shown us here, I can do that, of course." Darkness also says says I'd love to watch, but I gotta go to go gotta go get prepared. Absolutely understand, man. Good luck. Like I said, I will have you on. I'll pop in the chat every once in a while just to say what's up. Final. So the Orioles win five to two. 
that was the home opener for the Pirates, and the and the uh, Orioles get the win. Yes, sir. So let me actually go over since Steve's done. Let me go over to Darkness's page and just have him ready here. All right, I got I got that waiting. So we'll show him some support tonight. Still waiting for first pitch here. Hunter Green throws three main pitches, a slider, which he throws 51% of the time. Four seam fastball, 43%, and a splitter, 6%. So here we go. At first pitch in the Lindor is in for a strike, 0 and 1. Lindor 1 for 24 on the season. Whoa, bounced in the dirt. And it hit him. So he's hit by a pitch. So that'll bring up Alonzo. Alonzo hit the solo home run in the bottom of the ninth. Uh, in the second game yesterday to tie that game up at one. And then the Mets were able to add another run uh, after that to get their first win of the year. First pitch to Alonzo is in for a strike, going one. Let me get this over here so I can... I don't want to be spoiled by the uh, tracker. The 0-1, up and in, 1-1. One and one. The 1-1 one, one pickoff throw. Oh, Lindor back in. That was close. Let's see. Here's the replay. Lindor's... Safe. He was safe. He he dove back in the first base on the back side of the bag. That's the only reason why he was safe. So the count's one on one to Alonzo still. The pitch. It fouled away down the first base side. One and two. Hey, spaceman, what's up? How are you doing today, spaceman? The one two fouled off in on the hands. So we'll do it again. A lot of close time out here. The one two. Oh, that one lined out the left, but right at steer. He'll make the catch. One away. That'll bring up Alvarez. Spaceman says, just got back from work after a hot hot day. Since my area it's roasting. Roasting, he says. Hey, Kim is here. What's up, Kim? Overlord CK. Says, good luck to the Mets. About to head out of town, so I'll be around after the weekend. Sounds good, buddy. Be safe. Hey, Daniel Berry Sports Highlights is here saying happy Friday, everyone. The old one Alvarez. Swung on a miss, 0-2.
Darkness says he's excited for the stream. Yeah, I'm excited for you, man. That one fouled away. Still low and two. We got already. We already got 14 people hanging in the chat. Welcome in, everyone. Timeout called here by Alvarez. Count still low and two. The door was hit by a pitch. Uh, still sit, still standing at first base. Since thanks, man, all the support helps. Oh, swung on a miss at a pitch inside. 100 miles an hour on the gun. Two away. That'll bring up Brett Beatty. Beatty scored the game-winning run in game two of the doubleheader yesterday. The door. Oh, he gets back. They had him leaning towards second. Safe. Safe. Nope. Safe again. First pitch to Beatty's outside. Want to know? The 1 0. Ooh, down low. They checked on a third. No swing. 2 0. Last year, Lindor stole 31 bases, was safe 88.5% of the time. Swung on a mess, two and one to count. Already got 21 people checking out the stream. Welcome in, everybody. The 2 1. That one fell the way down the left field side, two and two. Green up to 15 pitches here in the first. The door got on uh, after he was hit by a pitch. Alonzo lined out the left, and Alvarez struck out. The 2-2, two, two, green deals inside, 3-2. and two. Or, uh, Lindor should be able to get a jump from first here. Yep, they're playing behind him now. And there he goes. Got tapped foul. Still three and two. The three, two. That one blooped in the left field, and it's a fair ball. Throw to third, the door is safely. Beatty goes to second. We'll see how they rule it. See if it's a single or a double. Oh, it's a double. And just landed inside the bag past third base. Oh, caught the foul line. First pitch to Marte swung on a miss, 99 miles an hour. In the doubleheader yesterday, combined the Mets were three for 20 with runners in scoring position. Marte off to a tough start here with a 227 average. Inside, one on one.
So one one. Swung on a miss. That pitch was outside. One and two. The one two. Oh, called strike three on the inside corner. Got him. We go bottom one, still scoreless. The Reds line up tonight. It'll be Jonathan India leading off. Spencer Steer batting second. And Carnacion Strand will bat third. Candelario will bat fourth in DH tonight. Fairchild uh, fifth. De La Cruz sixth. Espinol uh, will bat seventh. Benson eighth. And Luke Maley will bat ninth. The Mets defense, it'll be Beatty at third, Lindor at short, McNeil at second, Alonzo at first. Alvarez doing the catching and the outfield defense, Taylor in left, Bader in center, and Marte in right. So we got 26 people watching. Welcome in the Pure Adrenaline Sports, everybody. We got eight likes on the stream already. Let's go. We got nine votes in the poll as well. 67% saying Mets, 11% saying Reds, 11% also hoping for a great game, and 11% are just here to join the Mets emotional drinking group. So if you haven't already, hit that thumbs up for us. We really appreciate that. Let's see. So the Orioles game is final. They're now 5-2 and two on the year. Uh, Pittsburgh, it was Pittsburgh's home opener. They're 6-2. and two. Uh, Other games going on right now. Top of the ninth, the Rockies... Have a 6-3 lead over the Rays uh, in their home opener. Padres and Giants uh, tied up at two in the Giants' home opener. Phillies and Nationals going to the bottom of the first now. Diamondbacks and Braves at 720. Astros and Rangers at 805. Mariners at 810 against the Brewers. Red Sox against the Angels at 938, which I believe Thomas Fitzpatrick uh, is doing over on his channel tonight. So, Fitzy, what's up, buddy? Tony, what's up? Welcome back. First pitch swinging right out to Harrison Bader in center. Loud out there. One away, though. Quintana last year, though, 13 starts, 3-6 and six record. 3.57 ERA in 75 and two-third innings. Struck out 60, walked 24. Opponents batted 260 against them. Uh, first pitch is up high here to steer. Fitzy says, you turned on subscriber only mode. I did. If somebody wants to put in, uh, type something in the chat, they'll have to subscribe and wait 60 seconds. And then they can type in the chat. Steer on the young season, batting 435 with one home run and eight runs batted in. Up high, three and one to count. Uh, fouled off three and two to count.
the three two, and that one's cranked at the left field, at the wall, and it's gone. Spencer Steer with a solo home run, and it's one nothing Reds. Second home run of the year, ninth RBI on the year as well. Second home run Quintana's given up this season. First pitch, and Encarnacion Strand is inside. Want to know? There's a strike. One on one. On the outside corner, one and two. Timeout here by Encarnacion Strand. Swung on a miss. He struck him out. Two away. That'll bring up Candelario. Batting 167 on the season. That's four for 24. One home run. Two runs batted in. Fouled off. Candelario fouled that off his foot. Or maybe his knee. Taking a timeout. A home plate umpire give, gave him timeout to walk that off. Mm. Deal one from Quintana. He deals inside. One and one. Ooh, off the plate. Two and one. Oh, the Rockies and Rays are tied at six. The 2-1. Two, There's a strike, two and two. Darkness has two minutes. Man, get excited, Darkness. Darkness is going to do his first uh, live play-by-play -play over on his channel. Down low, three and two. I believe it's the Flyers and Sabres tonight. I believe Flyers and Sabres. Yep. Thomas asking what he's streaming. All right, here's the three two. Quintana deals. Down low, ball four. So a two out walk. That'll bring up Fairchild. Three for eight on the young season. That's a three seventy five average. No homers. No runs batted in. Does have a couple stolen bases on the air. First pitch is down low. One and up. Quintana. Quintana having some issues here with the strike zone. Up to 18 pitches here in the first. Oh, that one grounded down to Beatty. Knocked down. He gets up. Throws it over to first. That'll retire the side. 
But the Reds get the one on this tier solo shot. We go to the second. It'll be Taylor, McNeil, and Bader for the Mets. We got 23 people watching. We got 15 likes on the stream already. 20 votes in the poll. Let's go. Appreciate each and every one of you being here. We got 55% saying Mets, 25% saying Reds, 5% hoping for a great game, and 15% saying they want to join the Mets emotional drinking group. Bring your favorite beverage, unsponsored, by the way, unsponsored. Gained another sub. That's two so far this stream. Let's go. Really appreciate you guys. Oh, he doesn't have it where you can leave a comment. Let me refresh it. All right, let's come back over once again for the Mets. Taylor, McNeil, and Bader. Green back out on the mound for a second inning of work. That one tapped to first. Nice play there. Got him. Great play by Encarnacion uh, Strand to make the play. Green covered. One away. So that'll bring up McNeil struggling on the air. One for 15. Takes the first pitch strike. That's an 06. That's a .067 batting average. That one blooped foul. 0 and 2. Nimmo, Lindor, and McNeil this season. Three for 60. That one popped up behind the plate. It'll go out of play. Steer comes in to make the catch off of that. So two away. So that'll bring up Bader. Fakes a bunt on the outside corner, 0-1.
Swung on a miss, 0 and 2. Bader takes a timeout. Jose is here saying, uh, Buenos noches. I believe that means good night. Uh, from Amaspa. Forgive me if I did not pronounce that correctly. But welcome in. Oh, check swing. Tapped foul. Still low and two. To 02 fouled away, still low and two. Fouled off again, still low and two. The O2 from Green. Swung on a mess. One, two, three inning there for Green. We go bottom two, still one nothing Reds. It'll be De La Cruz, Espanol, and Benson. All right, we got 16 likes on the stream already, 23 votes in the poll. If you haven't already, please hit that thumbs up. Vote in the poll there in the chat as well. Uh, Rays now have a 7-6 to six lead over the Rockies. What a comeback there for the Rays. Let's see how they did that. They scored five runs in the ninth. Oh, some errors. Uh, the Phillies have an early one nothing lead over the Nats. Uh, that came in the top of the second as well. Is that Rays game in Colorado? Yes, it is. Yep. Uh, Phillies up one nothing, like I said. Runners on second and third for Schwarber still. Fitzy, I haven't looked at the weather report. How's your uh, How's your Red Sox game looking tonight against the Angels? Hey, Charles Adderley is here. What's up, Charles? Sam Pure Journal and Sports Network. How's everyone doing tonight on the live stream broadcast? Doing good. <coughs> Excuse me. Doing good tonight, Charles. How are you this evening? First pitch is down low. Uh, as De La Cruz steps in. No rain, just windy. Okay. Charles says, I just smashed that like button. Charles, thank you so much. The 1 0. Swung on a missed 1 1. The 1 1. Tap foul 1 and 2.
the one two down low two two. Charles says weather update from the Bahamas: eighty one degrees Fahrenheit, winds from the north at twelve miles an hour. Expected low temperature seventy degrees. Charles says he's great tonight in paradise. Thanks. The two two. Ta tapped in front of the plate. Foul. The two two from Quintana. Swung on a miss. Nice pitch. One away. Second strikeout of the night for Quintana. Espinal swings and fouls off the first pitch, 0-1. Charles says 17 likes and climbing. Let's go. Let's go, buddy. The 01. Outside 101. The 1 1. Bounced in the dirt, two and one. Here's the two one. Quintana winds and deals. Grounded down to third, but foul. Two and two. The 2-2 two -two from Quintana. Inside, 3-2. and two. The 3-2. Three, two. And grounded to Lindor short. Plays it on a hop over to Alonzo, two away. That'll bring up Will Benson. Benson batting 261 on the year. Six, uh, six hits and 23 at-bats. Three runs scored. Four runs batted in. Has one home run. Has struck out 11 times already. The first pitch is tapped right to Lindor. He'll grab it. Throw over to first. So a nice one, two, three inning there for Quintana. We go to the third. Still one nothing Reds. All right, let's look. So, uh, like Charles said, 17 likes on the stream, 31 votes in the poll. 58% saying Mets, 29% saying Reds, 3% hoping for a, a great game, and 10% want to join the Mets emotional drinking group. Fitzy says, all righty, Mets, we need some offense.
I don't know why. Darkness was here promoting his stream, but it's not on. So I don't know what's up. So let's look at the NHL tonight. The Flyers and Sabres, no score, 15 minutes to go there in the first. Red Wings and Rangers, no score, 15 minutes to go. Capitals have a one nothing lead over the Hurricanes, 15 minutes to go in the first. Avalanche and Oilers tonight at 9. Golden Knights and Coyotes at 10. And Kraken and Ducks also at 10 o'clock tonight. Phillies now have a 3 nothing lead over the Nats. Bottom of the ninth uh, in Colorado. Uh, Rays with that 7-6 to six lead, but the Rockies have runners on first and second and nobody out. Hey, Farhan is here. How are you doing this evening, Farhan? DJ Stewart lines one foul down the right field side, 0-1. Once again, it'll be Stewart, Lindor, and Alonzo, 9 1 and 2 in the Mets lineup. Stewart's 0 for 9 on the year. Tried to check a swing, but he went 0 and 2. Darkness, what happened to your stream, bud? I saw it, and then it went away. Charles Zetterly says Friday night baseball. Oh, down low, 1 and 2. Uh, action is fantastic. Coverage on Pure Adrenaline Sports. Farhan says he's doing well. He says, I don't know. I tried to stream, but it crashed. Up up high, two and two. Frank, welcome in. Saying hello to everybody. What's up, Frank? Uh, bounced in the dirt, three and two. Nice that back here uh, by Stewart. Was down 0-2 in the count, and now it's even. Green up to 41 pitches here with nobody out in the third. Fouled off, still 3-2. and two. Frank says, thank you. No, thank you for being here. Let, it, let me know if you're a fan of one of these two teams or if you're just checking out the stream. Timeout called here by Stewart. Swung on a miss. He struck him out 100 miles an hour. That's the fourth strikeout for Green tonight. He says, you may not like me, but I am a Reds fan. That doesn't matter. All fans are welcome here. Charles says we're balling tonight as a well-oiled machine, united force standing tall against all odds. <laughs> Pure Adrenaline Sports Network. Crushing it tonight, man. We're up to 2297. Thank you to all the new subs. We've gained three so far since the stream started. That'll bring up Lindor. He was hit by a pitch his first time up and was stranded at third. The 1 0. Oh, outside, 2 0. Frank says, thank you for your courtesy. The 2 0 to Lindor fouled, fouled back off the catcher's mask, 2 and 1. Frank said he subscribed and hit the like button. Thank you so much. And Sports, I see your comment. Oh, swung on a miss, two and two. And Sports Collection says, dude, I can't even watch the Mets anymore. It sucks that they can't hit, but they can pitch good. Yeah, but I know we're only six games in, but right now have the best ERA in the National League. Fouled off, still two and two. Charles says, fair and balanced discussion. All are welcome on Premier Journal and Sports Network. Yes. Fitzy saying, smash that thumbs up and subscribe. Thank you, Fitzy. 
That one popped up on the infield. And Carnacion Strand will come over to make the catch. Two away. That'll bring up Alonzo. He lined out to the left field this first time. Once again, Alonzo with that solo shot last night in the bottom of the ninth to tie that game at one. The first pitch is outside, 1 0. Frank says Green's pitching good. He is. Uh, only concern right now is pitch count's a little high. He's at 50, uh, where after three, you want to be about 40 to 45. Uh, 2 0 the count to Alonzo. Says, wow, the, Har the Marlins are horrible. Yes, they are. Well, and they have a lot of injury problems. Their two best starting pitchers are out for the year uh, and both need Tommy John surgery. That one fouled off, two and one. They're showing the Alonzo home run yesterday. Hit it off his shoe tops. Two and one count. The two one down low, three and one to Alonzo. The three one fell straight back, three and two. Fitzy says Alonzo with that golf swing home run. Yep. And last night when he when I was calling it. Uh, I could definitely tell it was going to be between the two, uh, left fielder and center fielder into the gap, and it just kept carrying. The 3 2. Oh, takes, takes strike three looking right down the middle of the plate. Strikeout number five for Green. We go bottom three, still 1 0 Reds. It'll be 9 1 and 2 uh, for the Reds again. Charles says, discipline is the bridge between goals and accomplishments. Up to 21 likes on the stream, 37 votes in the poll. Let's see, what time is Fitzy's game? Oh, 9.30. Fitzy, I think I'll be done. I think I'll be done before I can send anybody over to you. We'll see how long this one goes, though. Uh, they got to stop putting games on Apple TV. Uh, no. Apple TV paid a lot of money to have the rights to Friday Night Baseball. Pitsy says, I'm shocked that it was snowing in Pittsburgh in April. <laughs> I was looking at <laughs> I was looking at Twitter and somebody said it's Pirates opening day at home and it looks like a Steelers game. <laughs> uh Sabres have a one nothing lead over the Flyers. Ten minutes to go in the first. Red Wings and Rangers tied at one. Uh, Arlen says, you all hear about the earthquake that hit New York? Well, it hit in New Jersey and only an hour from where I am here in Pennsylvania. And we felt it. First pitch from Quintana is in for a strike, 0 and 1. And Sports says LFGM. We got to wake our bats up before it's too late, man. 
A ground ball is short. Lindor is there. Over to first. One away. Three straight ground outs is short. Going back to last inning. Farhan says, oh, gosh. They're still accessing damage. So far, no serious casualties. There's a strike to India, 0-1. Oh, Outside, 1-1. One one. Quintana here with one out in the third, up at the 36 pitches. The 1-1, one, one. down low, 2-1. The two one inside three and one. The three one tap foul three and two. Here's the 3 2. That one lifted over Lindor's glove in the left field for a one out single. That'll bring up Steer. Steer homeward his first time up. That was his second home run of the year, ninth RBI for him. Oh, called the strike on the inside corner, 0-1. Fouled off, one and two the count. The Rockies come back and beat the Rays 10 to 7. <laughs> Wonder if it was a grand slam. Up and in, two and two. Pick off throw. India back in. The 2-2. Two -two. Quintana, another throw over to first. So that's it. That's his two throws. We'll see if India takes off now. Doesn't have a stolen base yet this season. The 2-2. Two -two. Tapped foul down the first base side. Still 2-2. Two and two.
to two two. Up high, three and two. Quintana now up to uh, yeah up to forty six pitches here in the third, so he's got his pitch count a little high. The three two down low ball four, the runner was going, but it doesn't matter. That'll bring up Encarnacion Strand, who struck out his first time up. But the Reds threatening here with one out in the third. Just gained another sub. Thank you to whoever that was. Really appreciate that. We've gained four so far tonight. We got 35 watching. We got 22 likes on the stream. Thank you all so much. 38 votes in the poll. Let's go. Mets are in trouble. It's game over knowing the Mets can't hit. The first pitch to Strand. Popped up. Alvarez sheds the mask. Gives chase. And Alonzo comes over and he makes the catch. What a catch by Alonzo in foul territory. Two away. That'll bring up Candelario, who walked in the first. First pitch to Candelario. Called a strike, 0 and 1. Oh, uh, according to the tracker, it just missed. The 0 1. Quintana looking at the runner at second. Now he deals up high, 1 and 1. The so one one down low, two and one. Wow, we're up to forty one people watching. Welcome in, everyone. The two one from Quintana inside, three and one. That, according to the tracker, that one did get the corner. Now it's called on the outside. Now it's three and two. Three and two the count. Here's the 3-2. Called strike three. Got him looking. That'll retire the side. We go to the fourth. Still one nothing Reds. For the Mets, it'll be Alvarez, Beatty, and Marte. Fitzy says, come on, Quintana need to throw some strikes. Yeah, he's getting his pitch count up there, too. About 37 watching right now. Thank you all so much. We got 22 likes on the stream already. 38 votes in the poll. 58% saying Mets. 29% saying Reds. 3% hoping for a great game. And 11% saying 
say they want to join the Mets emotional drinking group. All right, Fitzy, uh, I know you said you're doing a game tonight. Make sure you post your link in there so people can check you out if they want to hang out during the Red Sox game. If your stream starts before we end, I'll send everybody over to you. Phillies still lead the Nats 3 0. Uh, the Diamondbacks scored three in the top of the first and have a 3 0 lead there. Let's see how they scored. Could tell Marte led it off with a uh, solo home run and uh, then Suarez a two out, two run double. There's, there's Fitzy's uh, channel, guys. Make sure you check out Thomas Fitzpatrick. Covers a lot of Boston Red Sox, a lot of Boston Bruins hockey. C. Lee is here. What's up, buddy? Saying this. What is this? More baseball? Yes, sir. All the baseball here at Pure Adrenaline Sports. Alvarez, that was a defensive swing. That ball was way inside. Quickly behind 0-2. Calls timeout. Up high. One and two. Yep. See Lee saying hi to everybody. Here's the one, two. Way up and out of the zone, strong swung on a miss. Fitzy says off topic. But if the Flyers made the playoffs, would you stream any of their games? Uh I don't know, Fitzy. Hockey's a little tough to do right now. Oh, Beatty hit one out to the left the right center field. But Fairchild's there to make the catch. Stop with the interviews with the managers while your pitches are happening. Uh, what did the O's do? The O's won 5-2 to two today. 5-2 to two for the O's. In the snow in Pittsburgh. There's a strike to Marte. Marte struck out his first time up. The O one up high one on one. Hunter Green up to sixty two pitches here with two outs in the fourth. The one one in for a strike one and two. And grounded down the third. Uh, Espinal over the first. Only a nine pitch inning for Green, so that'll help get the numbers down. But we go bottom four. Still one nothing Reds. It'll be Fairchild, De La Cruz, and Espinal coming up. Uh, 
Uh, the White Sox and Royals are underway. That came in the first. Finals from earlier. Toronto beat the Yankees 3-0. Detroit beat Oakland 5-4. The Cubs beat the Dodgers 9-7. The Rockies uh, won 10-7 over Tampa Bay. We'll look to see how they won that one in a minute. 5-2, uh, Baltimore beat Pittsburgh. And San Francisco beat San Diego 3-2. Other games tonight, Houston and Texas at 8, Seattle, Milwaukee at 8.10, and Boston and the Angels tonight at 9.38. Uh, no, Cam is traveling. I believe he's going home to Texas this weekend, so he's traveling right now. Yes, McMahon hit a home hit a grand slam home run to win. So Tampa Bay scores five in the top of the ninth. <laughs> and Colorado gets four in the bottom of the ninth. Uh, end of the first period, the Sabres lead the Flyers 1-0. Just under three minutes to go, uh, the Rangers and Red Wings tied at one. Capitals have a 1-0 lead over the Hurricanes. I'm drinking coffee just for tonight's game. That means you'll be up all night, Seeley. Frank says, my friend, who is your favorite Met of all time? Uh, David Wright is my favorite man of all time. And that one drilled out to left field. Foul ball. Fairchild almost made it 2 nothing. Fairchild grounded out to Beatty his first time up. He goes, ah, David Wright. Yep. That one lifted out to left. Taylor on the run, and he'll make the catch. One away. That'll bring up De La Cruz. Struck out his first time. Tom Terrific Seaver was my choice. Well, I'm not old enough. I don't remember when Seaver played. De La Cruz, fair ball down the line. Taylor will come over to get it. De La Cruz will at least pull in the second, and he'll stop there. So a one-out double. Fitzy says, my favorite Met is Mr. Met. <laughs> That'll bring up that'll bring up Espinal. He grounded out to short his first time up. My favorite my favorite Met is Nolan Ryan. Problem was when he was with the Mets, he wasn't the Nolan Ryan that he became. Down in the dirt, one on one. It wasn't until he went to the Angels and then the Astros. Oh, pickoff throw back to second. De La Cruz back in. Frank says, does anyone remember the sign guy in the seats? He was great holding up the signs. 
He says, yes, but I wanted to remain loyal. All right, I got you. Jaden says, good win for the Tigers today. Yeah, back in the win column. Uh, two balls and a strike here to Espinal. One out here in the fourth. Quintana up to 60 pitches. So a little bit higher than where you want your guy to be in the fourth. The 2-1. Swung on a mass 2-2. Two and two. Frank says Nolan Ryan can throw a ball through a car wash and never get wet. Oh, hold the swing, three and two. If you guys have never seen it, look up Nolan Ryan. Oh, what was his name? Robin Ventura. Nolan Ryan and Robin Ventura. Look it up. But that one popped up. Out to right. Marte comes in, calls off McNeil, two away. <laughs> My second favorite Met is Michael Tonkin. <laughs> well, it was the Ryan Express. Phillies are, hey, David, what, what's up? Phillies are up 3 nothing, but messed up in the third. Second and third with nobody out. Harper tried to steal home, got caught, and then two quick outs. No, it looks good today so far. How are you today? David, I'm good. David, did you feel the earthquake today? Oh, and one. I believe David's a little bit closer to that to where uh, the earthquake happened than I am. But we felt it up here. That one popped out the left. Taylor over towards the line will make the catch, so the double doesn't hurt. We go to the fifth. Still one nothing Reds. Let me get back to the chat here. Welcome in, everybody. 34 people watching. Make sure you hit that thumbs up. We have 23 likes on the stream, 44 votes in the poll. Uh, you're right, Ryan Express. Yep, I was watching that game when it happened. <laughs> and Steve says, did you feel the earthquake? Yes, Steve, we did. Yes, we did. Uh, the Braves got one in the bottom of the first. Albie scored a run. It's three to one now. White Sox and Royals no score. Bottom one. The Astros Rangers begin in about ten minutes. Mariners Brewers in about twenty minutes, and then Red Sox and Angels later tonight. Yep, Rob said he felt the earthquake in Jamaica, Queens. Who remembers the Harrelson and Rose fight in the playoffs? 
Uh, yes, yeah, Steve. I'm in. I'm in uh, Pennsylvania. That that fight was in 1973. I was. <laughs> I wasn't. Uh, if it was if it was during the season, I wasn't born yet. Two and one to count to Taylor. Down low, three and one. Rob says he watched it. Steve says he went to Jamaica High School. Paul Moore, so a leadoff walker for the Mets. That'll bring up McNeil. McNeil flat out to left this first time. First time. C. Lee says, not me. Frank says, I was 13, and the Mets won the playoffs. Well, if you're talking 73, they lost to the A's in the World Series that year. Uh, laced foul. Oh, and won the count. And it was Bud Harrelson. Yeah, Bud Harrelson. Oh, and one to count to McNeil. That one laced foul as well. Oh, and two. Uh, see, I remember Vita Blue at the end of his career. Here's the O2. That one popped up. Foul territory. And Carnacion Strand comes over, and he'll make the catch. One away. That'll bring up Harrison Bader. He struck out his first time up. Oh, off the plate, one and oh. Tap up the first base side, it goes foul, one and one. Steven says, saw Pete Rose at the at Shea uh, set the 44 game hit streak. One on one to count here. Green's getting ready to throw his 70th, 75th pitch with one out here in the fifth. Pick off throw. Taylor back in. Lace. Foul down the right field side. One and two. CD says they let us watch it in school. That's the most I remember of Vita Blue. The one, two. Fouled off again. The one, two, and in between first and second in the right field for a base hit. Tyler will hold it second. Some runners on first and second here. Green Juice says, you guys float those shakes. Feel them? Yes, we felt them. Steven said, also saw Seaburn in 69 pitch a one hitter versus the Cubs. Let's 
swung on a missed uh, by Stewart. Stewart struck out his first time up. Still looking for his first hit. He's over 10 on the year. Down low, one on one. The one one. There, that's in for a strike. Ball gets away. Runners hold. Still uh, counts one and two now. Rob, as I remember when Jimmy Qualls broke up Tom Seaver's perfect with one out in the eighth. See, these saying Seaver was awesome. Oh, it hit, it hit him. The Mets had the bases loaded with one out here. Back to the top of the lineup with Lindor, who's 0 for 1. He was hit by a pitch in the first. I believe it was in the ninth, and Seaver threw a no-hitter in a red uniform. What year did Johan throw the first one? 2020 or 2012? Was that 2012? All right, here's Lindor. Bases loaded here, one out. Big spot for the Mets here. Green up to 81 pitches. Oh, that ball way inside. Almost hit him. 1-0. Oh. Career with bases loaded. Lindor, 95 at-bats. He's got six career grand slams. 337 average. 95 uh, runs batted in as well. So we'll take it. He's averaging at least one RBI per at bat. So we'll take another one here to at least tie it. Kitsy says, All righty, Mets, big chance to score. The 1 0 on the inside corner, 1 and 1. Here's the 1-1. One, one. Green sets and deals. And that one hit out to right field. Ben, well, Fairchild will make the catch. The throw home is cut off, and the Mets have tied the game. Lindor's first RBI in the year. Still runners on first and second here with two outs now. But Alonzo up. Also at the World Series game where Clemens, Clemens threw the bat at – threw the broken bat towards Piazza, right? Appeal, appeal is unsuccessful, so the game is tied one to one. Green up to 85 pitches here with two outs. Alonzo high on the first pitch. Here's the one out. Oh, that one popped up. And Carnacion strand in foul territory. He'll make the catch. 
that'll retire the side, but the Mets get the one. And we're tied up at one, going to the bottom of the fifth. For the for the Reds, it'll be nine one and two. Thirty-four people watching, twenty-five likes on the stream, forty-seven votes in the poll. Thank you all so much for being here. Make sure you hit that thumbs up for us. Consider subscribing, and please vote in the poll as well. Sixty-two percent saying Mets win tonight. Twenty-six percent saying Reds. Yes, yeah, see these saying, "Come on, Mets." This looks good, this preview. Manhunt, that looks good. About the assassina assassination of Abraham Lincoln. Hey, Orioles Birdwatcher, welcome in. Congrats on another O's win. How'd your stream go, though? And that one laced in the right field. That'll get down for a leadoff single. Back to the top of the lineup here. That'll bring up India. He's one for two with a single and a flyout. First pitch to India is on the outside corner for a strike. The 0 1 inside 1 1. The 1 1. Up high, two and one. Oh, that one laced in the left field for a base hit over Lindor's glove. So back to back singles here. That'll bring up Steer with runners on first and second. Nobody out. Steers one for one with that solo home run in the first and walked into third. Numbers down across the board, hopefully picking up more over the weekend. Yeah, less than 10 when on the night's getting 20 to 30 or so. Wow. I wonder if it's because it was a here in the states. It was a a day game. No, I usually do pretty good on day games, though. So. 
All right, Quintana deals. Oh, that one fouled off the foot of Alvarez. Oh, and one. Just got a piece of it. People were probably preoccupied with the earthquake. That could be. The 01 inside 101. And that one, oh, caught by Beatty on a diving catch. I believe that is what they call a web jet. Time to dive perfectly. He says, cool catch. Now, that ball gets into the outfield. That's at least one. First pitch is on the inside corner. 0-1-2 in Encarnacion Strand. He's 0-2 for two today. Struck out and fouled out to Alonzo at first. Deal one. Down low, 1-1. One one. Timeout called. Quintana up to 75 pitches here with one out in the fifth. So neither pitcher probably going to go any more than six innings. <laughs> okay, hot catch. <laughs> the 1-1. One, one. Off the plate, 2-1. That one hit out to right, but it'll go foul. Two and two. The two two. Strand hits one out to center. Bader on the run. Then he'll make the catch before the track. Gets the ball back in. The runners hold. Two away. That'll bring up Candelario. He's walked and struck out. So the Reds started off with back-to-back -back singles, but then a, a catch by Beatty at third, and then Colonel Rossi and Strand hits that fly ball out to center. Quintana had a chance to get out of this one. The first pitch to Candelario, lined. Beatty plays it on a hop over to Alonzo. That'll retire the side. So we go to the six. We're tied at one. Let's see. 
Yup, it bounced. Going to the six. We got 25 likes on the stream. We got 48 votes in the poll. 62% saying Mets. 25% saying Reds. 10% just want to join the Mets Emotional Drinking Group. If you're joining the drinking group, what are you all drinking? Finals from around the majors earlier today. The Blue Jays beat the Yankees 3-0 in the Yankee home opener. Tigers beat the A's 5-4 in their home opener. Uh, the Cubs beat the Dodgers 9-7. Rockies in their home opener hit the uh, Grand Slam home run in the bottom of the ninth to win 10-7. Orioles beat the Pirates 5-2 in the Pirates' home opener. The Giants in their home opener beat the Padres 3-2. Fitzy says he's drinking mud water. I'm drinking my doctor. Games that are going on right now. Here we're tied up at one. The Phillies lead the Nationals 3 0 in the fifth. Diamondbacks lead the Braves 3 1 in the third. White Sox and Royals tied at one in the third. Astros and Rangers just underway. Mariners and Brewers just underway as well. See, Lee says now, now he's drinking wine. Before it was coffee, now it's wine. NHL action tonight. Sabres lead the Flyers 1-0 halfway through that one. Uh, Rangers and Red Wings tied up at 2. 16 and a half minutes to go in the second. Capitals lead the Hurricanes 2-0. That game 15, uh, just under 16 minutes to go in the second. Oh, later tonight, he says. Avalanche and Oilers at 9, Golden Knights and Coyotes at 10, and Kraken and Ducks at 10 as well. So it'll be Alvarez, Beatty, and Marte here for the Mets. Green still on the mound. The first pitch to Alvarez is lifted out to left. Steer comes running in. He'll make the catch. One away. That'll bring up Beatty. Beatty's one for two. Double in a fly out to center. First pitch to Beatty's down low. Want to know? The 1-0. Fouled, fouled back. 1-1. One one. The 1-1. One one. On the inside corner, one and two. One and two to Beatty. Green up to 91 pitches here. That one tapped foul, still one and two. The one two to Beatty. That one hit between short and third. And it'll go into left center field for a lead uh one out single. Beatty now two for three tonight. That'll bring up Marte. 
he struck out and uh, grabbed it out to third. Oh, the Flyers and uh, Sabres are tied up at one. Oh, inside, 1-0 and to Marte. The one out. Oh, on the inside corner, one and one. The one one swung on a miss, one and two. Marte back into the box. Green sets. Then deals the one two. Outside, they check down at first. No swing, two and two. The two two. Oh, that one hit out the center. Fairchild, a couple steps to his right, and he'll make the catch. Two away. That'll bring up Taylor. Taylor grounded it out the first and walked and scored uh, his last time up. And down to third, they go to second for the force. And that'll retire the side. We go bottom six, still tied at one. For the Reds, it'll be Fairchild, De La Cruz, and Espinal. We got 41 people watching. Welcome in, everyone. Oh, it just dropped down to 39. Still welcome in. 25 likes on the stream. If you haven't hit that thumbs up, please help us out. By doing that, let's uh, send the stream out to more people. 56 votes in the poll. 64% saying Mets. 25% saying Reds. NBA action tonight. Let's check that out. Oh, I think the women's final four is tonight as well, right? Uh, the Hornets lead the Magic at the half, 67-52. to 52. Pacers lead the Thunder, 69-59 to 59 at the half. Uh, starting the third, the Blazers lead the Wizards, 59-53. Celtics lead the Kings, 42-27. to 27, Six minutes to go in the first half. Bulls and Knicks, six and a half minutes to go in the first quarter. Bulls lead 13-9. Rockets lead the Heat, 14-11. Grizzlies trail the Pistons 13 to 11. Bucks lead the Raptors 10 to 9. Pelicans lead the Spurs 12 to 9. Warriors and Mavericks in about 10 minutes. T Wolves and Suns at 10. And Jazz and Clippers at 10 30. Thomas says, women's final four is tonight, which means RC probably won't be in the chat. Nope. Probably screaming at the television. Uh, they're in the third quarter there. South Carolina leads NC State in the women's tournament. And tonight at 9, it's UConn and Iowa.
Quintana's still on the mound. Quintana takes the first pitch outside, 1-0. and That pitch is in for a strike, one and one. Oh, a pie, two and one. The two one outside three and one. The three one swung on a miss three and two. The three two. Quintana deals called strike three. Got him looking. That's Quintana's fourth strikeout of the night. That'll bring it De La Cruz. He he was one of those strikeouts, but then doubled his last time and was stranded at second base. Quintana winds and deals down low, 1-0. Uh, down low again, 2-0. Hey, Cameron's here. What's up, Cameron? Saying, hey, Fitzy, Johnny, and C. Lee. The 2-0 to, to De La Cruz on the outside corner, 2-1. and one. Cameron saying, Johnny, let's go, Mets, let's go. Down low, 3-1. and one. Three and one the count. Quintana deals. Down to Beatty. Plays it on a hop on the run. Got him. Two away. Nice play by Beatty. That'll bring up Espinal. He's over two tonight with a ground out and a fly out to right. That one grounded foul down the third base side. 0 oh and 1. The 0 1. Down low, one and one. Quintana up to ninety two pitches here in the six. Probably his last inning of work. Down low, two and one. The two one down low, three and one.
to three one. Outside ball four. So a two out walk here. That'll bring up Benson. He's zero for two. I ground out the sh I ground out the short and the fly out to left. The first pitch on the outside corner, 0 and 1. The 0 1. Laced on the left field line, foul. 0 and 2. Here's the O2. Ooh, just missed one and two on the outside corner. Mm. The one, two, down low, two and two. Alonzo not paying attention. They had Espinal picked off, and Alonzo wasn't even paying attention. So a runner on second now with two out. Counts two and two. Down low, three and two. To three, two. Uh, fouled off. Got a piece of Alvarez there at, behind the plate. Still three and two. That foul ball got Alvarez on the inside of that knee pad. The pitch calm went flying. Hey, Bear Blitz is back. What's up, Bear? How are you doing this evening? The 3 2 outside ball four. Back to back walks here with two out. See if we get a pinch hitter here. Drew Smith getting warmed up in the Mets pen. Yep. We're getting a pitching change. First two guys out and then back-to-back -back walks here. Had had Benson 0-2 when he walked them. Bear says Cubs had a great game against the Dodgers. Yeah, congrats on the, the W there. He said, had I knew what you meant, Bear. All right, we got 49 people watching, 33 likes on the stream, 67 votes in the poll. Let's go. We'd really appreciate if you all hit that thumbs up for us. It does promote and push our content out to more people. 67 votes. Let's go. So we're getting a pitching change here. Let's check some other scores. Phillies still lead 3-0 over the Nats. Diamondbacks now lead the Braves 4-2. to 
uh, with runners on second and third in the top of the fourth with two out. Corbin Carroll's the batter. Uh, White Sox and Royals tied at one. That game in the bottom of the fourth. Top of the second, Astros and Rangers are scoreless. Mariners and Brewers, scoreless, going to the bottom of the second. Only other game that not getting started yet, Red Sox and Angels tonight at 938. Our buddy Thomas Fitzpatrick will be doing that game live on his channel. In, in women's uh, Final Four action, South Carolina leads NC State 61-37. to 37. That one going to the fourth quarter. I don't follow college sports enough. Why did why does women's college basketball play four quarters where the men's play two halves? Fitzy saying, let's go Sox. All right, Drew Smith will come in. Runners on first and second. Old. Well, throw down the second, back in. Are they calling interference and the Brunner's given third? He didn't block the bag. He fell over the runner after he slid back in the second. Oh, no, after they show the replay, that's blocking the bag. Yep, good call. So runners on first and third now. And it's a 1-0 and count here. Mets struggling here after they got the first two batters out. The one L up high, two and L. That's putting themselves in a in a bad spot here. Runners on the corners, two out. And that one popped up on the infield. Lindor waving everybody off, and he'll make the catch. We go to the seventh, still tied at one. Forty six people watching, still thirty three likes on the stream, sixty nine votes in the poll. Uh, next live stream will definitely, I don't know about tomorrow yet, haven't decided. The Mets and Reds are at 4 o'clock, so I haven't decided yet. Uh, but then definitely live on Sunday at 1.30 for Mets and Reds. And then Mets and Braves, a four-game series next week. We'll be live for all of those games as well. Uh, Sabres have a 2-1 to one lead over the Flyers. That game almost the end of the second period. For the Mets, it'll be the bottom of the lineup. McNeil, Bader, and Stewart. We are getting a pitching change. Fernando Cruz will come in for green.
All right, here we go. McNeil will lead it off. First pitch is down and low. Inside, 1-0. Uh, in, inside again, low, 2-0. Oh. The 2-0. Oh. Up and in, 3-0. Oh. The three zero, right down the middle, three and one. The three one, ripped foul down the first base side. Three and two. Cruz last year was in 58 games, made two starts, had a 1-2 and two record, 66 innings with a 4.91 ERA. Opponents batted 2-11 against them. The 3-2, swung on a miss to the ball down and low. One away. So McNeil now one for 18 on the season. First pitch to Bader. Uh, shows a bunt, but outside, 1-0. and Bader's one for two. Struck out his first time up. Singled uh, his second time up. Was stranded at second in that inning. Up high, 2-0. and To 2 0. Outside 3 0. Hey, Butterfly is here. What's up, Butterfly? Great to see you as always. Hopping in here in the seventh inning. We're tied up at one. The 3 0. A pie ball four. So the Mets get a one out base runner here with a walk. That'll bring up Stewart. Stewart's 0 for 1. Uh, his last at bat, though, he was hit by a pitch. CeeLo sending in a raid. Well, they might not be able to do that because I do have a subscriber only mode on. So I'm not sure if they're going to be able to do that. Butterfly also saying 33 likes. Let's go. First pitch was in there for a strike. Runner takes off, ball bounced in the dirt, throw the second, not in time. Bader stolen, uh, first stolen base of the year. Oh, a raid. They can, uh, then they can subscribe. Yes. <laughs> Tapped foul, one and two the count. See these saying good stream. Thanks, buddy. Hey, Kelly Duncan says CeeLo says hi. Kelly, tell CeeLo Pure Adrenaline says hello and thank you for the support. Down low, two and two. 
Fitzy says, I see 2,300 on the sub count. Congrats. Let's go. We've gained six this stream. Let's go. The 2-2. Two, two. Up high, 3-2. and two. We've had another great game. Coach N is here saying CeeLo says hello. Just subbed. Thanks, Coach N. Hey, Green Juice fans still here. What's up? Well, I guess that's the only bad part about putting it on subscriber only mode. Might not be able to get some raids. And that's ball four. So one out walk. Puts runners on first and second here and back to the top of the lineup. Yep, Butterfly saying welcome, everyone. So I can change that, guys. What do you guys think? Kelly says, I subbed. Thank you, Kelly. What do you guys think? We get some nonsense in the chat if we don't do it that way. But then if we do it that way, we might not get some new people coming in. C. Lee says, wow, 2300 That was quick. quick. Congratulations. Yeah, thank you all. The 1-0. -oh, up high, 2-0. -oh. But my regulars, what do you guys think? C. Lee says, says it works for Steve. Just leave it like it is. Lindor, uh, 0 for 1 tonight, was hit by a pitch in the first, popped out the first, and hit a sacrifice fly in the fifth inning that scored a run, and that's how we're, we're uh, tied up at 1. So the Mets have runners on first and second here. No hits yet this inning. See, Lee says, I got 52 in the chat. Let's go. It just hopped up to 56. Welcome in, everyone. Inside, 3-0. Farhan says, I feel it's fine the way it is. I haven't seen any nonsense, so I guess the process works. There's a strike, three and one. I say leave it. Yeah, no, I didn't mean change it now, but I mean just in general. The three one. Inside and low, ball four. The Mets have the bases loaded with Pete Alonzo coming up. Alonzo's uh, now 0 for 3, lined out to uh, left field, struck out and fouled out to first. Off to 59 watching. Let's go. People here in the Mets have the bases loaded. They want to see what's going on. The first pitch to Alonzo, swung on a miss, off speed, 0-1. Down low, 1-1. See these saying, come on, Mets. Yep, bases loaded here. One out here. Could use a big hit here. The 1-1 one, one to Alonzo. And that one up the middle. De La Cruz. And everybody's safe. I think I think Lindor's out at second. I want to see a replay. Two 
that'll go down as an E6, but I I think I think he's out at second. I want to see that again. Either way, the Mets take a two to one lead. No, he's safe. He is safe. Base is still loaded. Butterfly saying spike that like. Alvarez, first pitch is on the inside corner, 0-1. Ooh, that would have been close. If they would, if he would have cleaned that perfectly, I think they would have gotten the double play. The 0-1 to Alvarez, down low, 1-1. One -on -one. Uh, one out, C. Lee, one out. The Mets have a run in this inning without a hit. <laughs> the 1-1. One, one. Alvarez swings over the top of that, 1-2. and two. Tapped foul, still one and two. See, Lee says it's time for a grand slam. The one, two. Swung on a miss to the ball in the dirt. Alvarez has looked horrendous tonight. He's 0 for 4 with three strikeouts. Yep, got to move him out of that three spot. Maybe a little bit too much pressure on him. That'll bring up Beatty with bases loaded now with two outs. Beatty's two for three tonight. Back up to 59 people watching. Welcome in, everybody. Mets just took a two-to-one lead here in the seventh inning. First pitch to Beatty's inside, one and oh. Butterfly saying to ring that bell and sub it up. There's a strike, one on one. Inside, two and one. Alonzo. Oh, no, Alvarez. Yeah, Alvarez. One more. <laughs> Rule number one in baseball, be ready for anything. The 2 1 fouled it. Oh, no, he didn't foul it. Uh, swung on a miss, though. 2 and 2. Mm, late swing, too. That ball was behind him by the time he swung the bat. 2 and 2 to count. The 2-2. Two -two. Did I check down at third? No swing. Let's see. Nope, he didn't go. Good call. The 3-2. Lined up the middle. Oh, De La Cruz had him played perfectly, and he caught it. But the Mets get one to take a two to one lead. We go bottom seven.
All right, guys, let's repay the favor here. On the go with CeeLo, sent some people over, so let's go over. And tell them PAS sent you over there. Put it in the chat there. All right, guys, go over to CeeLo. Just give him a thumbs up. I don't know if he's got subscribe only on, but he's up to 11,000 subs on his channel. So we appreciate his support as well. And, of course, channel points uh, to anybody who goes over. C. Lee's over there. Thank you, C. Lee. Yep, C. Lee says he's on his way. C. Lee's over there right now. Fitzy's over there. Oh. S Smith's still in the game. The one one up high, two and one. Thank you, everybody who went over there. There's a strike, two and two. He has a really cool display. Yeah, he just changed that, too. I really like that. The 2-2. Two -two. Fouled off. Still 2-2. Two and -two. Butterfly saying, hello, chat. Happy to see you. All right. Well, Butterfly's over there. Count still two and two as that one's fouled off. Top of the lineup here for the Reds, India, Steer, and Carnacion Strand. The 2-2. Two -two. That one blooped out the right. Marte comes running in, and it'll play it on a hop. So a leadoff single. That's India's third base hit of the night. That'll bring up Steer. Steer's one for two in the night. Hit a solo shot in the first and lined out to Beatty in the fifth inning. Yep, I saw Thomas there. I saw a butterfly there. There's a strike going one. Let me just go back over and check. Uh, if somebody's over there, he'll say something so I can hear him. Here's the 01. <clears throat> oh. 
Oh, there's a ball one on one. The one one swung on a mess, one and two. Let me see if it'll let me. I saw a butterfly over there as well. There's called strike three. One away. Unable to find butterflies, so I gotta wait till butterfly chats again. Well, let me try it again. Carnacion line this Lindor go back to first not in time. Two away though. Let me try it again. Yeah, yep, let me try it again, butterfly. <laughs> there you go. And that one ripped into right field. That'll go down into the corner. Marte comes over to cut it off. That's going to save a run. So it'll be second and third with two out. That'll bring up Fair who's over for three tonight. Curtis Joseph saying, hey, P.S., just a random Blue Jays and Bucks fan dropping by. They hit the like and sub. Thank you so much, Curtis. Sandy's here as well. Welcome in, everybody. Really appreciate it. When I see Fitzy back, I'll give Fitzy his thousand points. I like that graphic C Lo Scott. I'm not gonna I'm not gonna copy him, but that's pretty cool. Oh, we're getting a pitching change here. We're getting a pitching change here with two outs. Curtis Joseph says, I swear butterflies tracked me. <laughs> That's the... No, I don't want to say the problem, uh, Curtis, but butterflies everywhere. Uh, C. Lee says Charles will be here soon with the weather report. Uh, he was already here, C. Lee. He might come back, but he was already here. Uh, South Carolina punches their ticket to the championship. 78-59 win over NC, NC State. They'll play the winner of UConn and Iowa. See, he says, oh. Let me get rid of that. My TV asking me if I'm still watching. No, I'm not watching. I'm watching the game.
But we're up to 39 likes on the stream. 84 votes in the poll as well. We have gained seven new subs tonight. Thank you to all the new subs. Uh, we're getting Tyler Stevenson to come in as a pinch hitter as well. Uh, it's Brooks, Brooks Raley coming in the pitch here for the Mets. So Stevenson, the righty, will come in to pinch hit. Fouls the first one off, 0-1. He's 3 for 16 on the year. That's a 188 average. That one tapped foul quickly behind 0-2. Butterfly says two more likes for 40. Let's go. Gained another sub. We're up to 2302. Thank you. Down low, one and two. The one, two. Oh, down low, two and two. The 2-2. Two, two. Down low. Full count. It was 0-2. Now it's full. Trying to paint the corners, get him to chase something instead of attacking him like he did with the first two pitches. Down low. Ball four. That'll load the bases. That'll bring up Ellie De La Cruz. He's two, uh, one for three tonight. Struck out, doubled, and grounded out the third. Oh, Fitzy probably getting ready for his stream in 30 minutes. Hey, RC. RC, you getting ready for your game, bud? All right, here's Ellie De La Cruz. First pitch is on the inside corner, 0-1. Bases loaded, Indy at third, Candelario at second, Stevenson at first. Second pitch is on the inside corner again, 0-2. Oh That's right, he was down 0-2 to Stevenson as well, and then he tried painting the corners. There's Fitzy, let me give Fitzy his points while he's here. Oh, just missed, 1-2. and two. Called strike three. Got him looking. We go to the eighth inning. That's up two to one. Let me get back to the chat here. Yep, Fitzy saying hi to RC. Curtis says, 
Uh, hit the like, and I have 42 likes, by the way. Good stream. Thank you so much, Curtis. Cover a lot of Mets baseball here. Mets baseball, Philadelphia Flyers hockey. Uh, we definitely do NFL coverage, but we do a lot of the primetime games. Now, RC said he's excited getting ready for the game tonight. Butterfly saying cheers, everyone. Thank you for your support. Yes, I do greatly appreciate it. We're up to 88 votes in the poll as well. 62% saying Mets, 24% saying Reds. Nine thirty. That game says that game's tipping off at nine thirty. Nine thirty-two to be exact. Well, the Flyers got one back now. Trail three to two. Tip it and rip it with his twenty-eighth of the year. The Capitals still up two to one over the Hurricanes. That's not good for the Flyers. We're getting a pitching change here for the Reds as well. For the Mets, it'll be Marte, Taylor, and McNeil. Emilio Pagan, the new pitcher, last season with the Twins, 66 games, one start, 5-2 and two record. Dio won. Swung on a mess, though, and two to Marte. Curtis says, cool, P.S., I'll definitely be around, plus I like the, wet the Mets way more than the Yankees. All right, sounds good, my man. Rising Rhino just went live, so... Depending on what time we are done here, I'll either send all you guys over to Rising Rhino's channel or Thomas Fitzpatrick's channel. Oh, cold strike three. Got Marte looking. Got to bring up Taylor. He's 0 for 2 tonight. Grounded out the first. Walked and scored a run. And grounded out to end the sixth inning. Pirates are plus 900 to win the Central. I might put a couple dollars on that. First pitch is outside to Taylor. More to know. Butterfly telling people to hit that sub button now. Outside and low, 2 no. Right now. now, right now, swung on a mass to the ball inside, two and one. Now, do I hit it now? No, no, now. The two one. Ooh, outside, three and one. That was close. The three one. Uh top of the strike zone, three and two. <laughs> That's a good time. <laughs> right now is the best time, C Lee. Right now. The three two. Fouled off. We'll do it again.
the three two. That one lifted out. Uh, first base side. Encarnacion Strand will make the catch. That one's tough. That ball hit like that. It sounds off the bat. It sounds like it's going to go out to the outfield, and it's a pop up in the infield. Oh, okay. That'll bring up McNeil. He's over three tonight. Flew out to left, fouled out to first, and struck out. One for 18 on the year. First pitch is outside. One and oh. Let's have four guys slumping. Somebody's got to get it going. And McNeil cracks one to right field. And that ball's out of here. Three to one Mets. That's not a normal celebration. <laughs> That'll bring up Bader. Swinging at the first pitch. That one popped into foul ground. Melee. Oh, up against the railing. Doesn't make the catch. A home plate umpire went out to the pitcher. Not sure why. Not sure what the delay is. All right. He's back behind the plate now. That one popped foul. 0 and 2 to Bader. Butterfly saying 41 likes. Keep them coming. Let's go. Thank you all so much for hitting that thumbs up. Time out. Time out called here. Oh, pitch clock violation on the batter. That's strike three. But the Mets, the Mets get the one, and it's now three to one as we head to the eight, bottom of the eighth. It'll be 7, 8, and 9 for the Reds, Espinal, Benson, and Maley. CV says he sees 42. Let me go over and look. I see 42 as well. Phillies have a 4 nothing lead over the Nats. That game in the top of the ninth inning. Diamondbacks have a 5-2 to two lead over the Braves. White Sox and Royals tied up at 1. Rangers have a 5-0 lead over the Astros. Yikes. Brewers have a 3-0 lead over the Mariners. And we're about 20 minutes away from Red Sox and Angels. Uh, here. UConn and Iowa getting ready to tip off here at 9.32. Yikes is right.
Just Have you all seen those commercials for the new iPhone 15 with deleting the uh, deleting the pictures? Another pitch clock violation. Off the end of the bat foul. Cancel that. Ottavino in the pitch here. One and two to count. Cold strike three. Got him looking. That'll bring up Benton. He's 0 for 2 with a walk tonight. Check swing. Back to Ottavino. He flips over to Alonzo. Two away. That'll bring up Maley. He's one for three tonight. Gained another sub. We're up to 23.03. That's nine on the night. Let's go. I know. What are you saying no about the Rangers and the Astro score? On the inside corner, 0 and 1. The 0 1 inside, 1 and 1. Fouled off, one and two. Uh, you asked a question, but I don't remember what. Oh, the iPhone 15 commercial about the uh, pictures, where the pictures are singing, asking not to get deleted. The one, two. Called strike three, got him looking. A 1 2 3 inning for Ottavino. We go to the ninth. Still 3 to 1 Mets. Let me set this up to go over to Fitzy. Because Fitzy should be streaming by the time we are done here. Thomas Fitzpatrick will be doing the Red Sox game tonight. Well, 
How come he's not showing up? Oh, because he's not live yet. That's right. All right, let's take a look at the scores here. Philly still lead 4 nothing. That game in the top of the ninth as well. Diamondbacks still lead the Braves 5-2. to two. White Sox and Royals tied at 1 going to the 8th. Rangers now have a 6 nothing lead over the Astros. Brewers have a 3 nothing lead over the Mariners. And... Uh, Red Sox Angels in about 15 minutes. Well, uh, Diaz, Diaz getting warmed up in the pen for the Mets. It'll be Stewart, Lindor, and Alonzo for the Mets. First pitch is taken for a strike. Getting another sub. That's 10. That's 10 on the stream, everybody. Let's go. Down low, one on one. Make sure you do, if you are sub, you have that notifications on. Still haven't decided if I'm doing Mets Reds tomorrow at 4, but we'll definitely be doing Mets Reds and Sunday at 1.30. And then Mets and Braves uh, for three of the four games will be live Monday, Tuesday, and Wednesday night. The 2 1 inside, 3 and 1. Down low, ball four. So Stewart's only 0 for 1 tonight. A couple walks tonight. Was hit by a pitch. But it's still slumping because he's 0 for 10. See, Lee says I'll be visiting my mother, so I don't think I'll be around tomorrow. Thank you for the heads up. We're getting a pinch runner here. It'll be short. Short will pinch run for Stewart. First pitch to Lindor is up high, 1 0. Oh, that one lined out the center. Benson comes running in. He'll settle under it, 1 away. Short stays at first. That'll bring up Alonzo. Alonzo's 0 for 4 tonight. Did reach on an error his last time up that put the Mets up 2 to 1. C. Lee says, uh, C. Lee says 93 votes on the poll. And Butterfly says, keep on liking. There's a strike to Alonzo 0 and 1. And we're up to 43 likes on the streams as well. Thank you all so much. 94 votes in the poll now. 64% Mets, 22% Reds. The 0 1 to Pete. Swap this. Shorts going. He's out by a mile. Two away. And it counts 0 2 to Alonzo. Oh, we're up to 23.05 on the sub count. Let's go. 
That means we've gained 11 tonight. Awesome stuff, everyone. Brady's blocking the bag. Why didn't they call it this time? He's blocking the bag. The 0-2. Alonzo lines one out to right field. Fraley will make the catch. We go bottom nine. It'll be Edwin Diaz coming in for the Mets, looking for his first save on the year. Up to 56 people watching, 43 votes or 43 likes on the stream, 96 votes in the poll. Let's go. Great stream again tonight, everybody. Baseball has been absolutely crushing it so far this season. Getting ready to have some dinner after I'm done. The wife made barbecue meatballs in the crock pot, so they're still going nice and hot. Check in on my flyers. Oh, they lost four to two tonight. Not good. Not good. I know it was a great season, and I, I know a lot of us hung out together for that. Betsy says barbecue meatballs. That sounds good right now. I'm sorry. You have to prepare for a stream. You can't worry about eating food right now. <laughs> <clears throat> 45 likes on the stream. Let's go. If you haven't already, please hit that thumbs up. Consider subscribing if you want to hang out for some more MLB action. Edwin Diaz in the, for the Mets for the same chance. He said, Shh, I'm sitting in my tent eating some chips. <laughs> I got it all set up to send everybody over to you, Fitzy, when I'm done. First pitch is in for a strike, 0 and 1. Fairchild's 3 for 4 tonight. Flew out the center in the first, but his last three at bats, he singled every time. And check swing. Oh, off of Diaz's glove, and Beatty can't play it. So we'll see how they rule that. But India is safe at first. Probably an E1. That's how I'm going to mark it. Well, David says, Phillies and Mets look like sharp winners tonight. Phillies 4 nothing. the Mets 3-1. to one. Well, S Spencer Steer coming up for the Reds is the tying run here, David. So we'll see if the Mets can hold on. First pitch to Steers off the plate, 1-0. and Hit off the back of Diaz's hand. The 1-0. Inside, 2-0. and If you're the Reds, this is exactly you wanted the top of the lineup coming up. Here's a 2-0 to steer. Oh, he's been calling that a strike all night, and this time it's a ball. 3-0. The 3-0. There's a strike right down the middle. 3-1.
to three one. Fouled off three and two. The three two way outside ball four. They checked out at first, but not even close. And Carnosian Strand will come up as the tying or as the winning run. The tying runs on first, winning run at the plate. Oh, for four tonight. Struck out, fouled out, flew out the center, and lined out the short. The first pitch. And right back up the middle, Lindor's got it. Just safe at second. I don't know about that. I don't think he's safe anyway. The Mets are saying challenge at second. He's out anyway. He's out anyway. Orioles bird watcher just in time for the exciting conclusion. Yes, you are. Fitzy says, all right, you got to go. See you later. Thomas is talking about food again. I think he's out at second, which would be a 6-6-3 six, 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 double play. Uh, but I don't know if there's enough to overturn it. It was called safe at second. Still waiting for the umpires here. Don't know why Lindor just didn't flip it to McNeil. See, Lee says, I don't think I'd like my meatballs that way. Can somebody call these professional leagues and tell them to say if they're going to keep it safe at second so it'll be runners on second and third with one out? So the tying runs now at second. That'll bring up Candelario. He's one for three tonight with a walk, a strikeout, a ground out, and that double. Candelario pops one up. Marte. Bader will come over. He'll make the catch. The throw to the plate is cut off. Runner still at second base, though. See, these says, says 45 thumbs up. Let's go. Come on, everyone. Let's get the total of 50. Let's go. All right, so two out now.
That one in for a strike. I don't even know who the batter is. Fairchild fouled off quickly ahead 0 and 2. No, it's not Fairchild. Or Jake Fraley. Jake Fraley down in the count 0 and 2. Up high 1 and 2. The one two up high two and two. So it was ahead own two, now it's two and two. Oh, and that ball gets away. Thompson goes over to third. So the tying runs ninety feet away. Orioles Birdwatcher says it's never easy, is it? And Diaz, this is the Diaz has pitched in three games this year. This is his fourth. And the other three games, non-save situations, he looked great. Now it's a save situation. He's struggling. The three two. Swung on a miss, struck him out, put it in the books. The Reds only get one. The Mets hold on for the 3-2 to two win in game one. CD says it's never over till it's over. Orioles bird watcher. Chicken, chicken. Win <laughs> winner, winner. Chicken dinner. Try my words this time, huh? Man, we were up to 69 people there at the end. We're up to 2,306 subs. That means we gave Gene 12 on tonight's stream. Thank you all so much. Orioles bird watcher putting in the Mets song there. Man, thank you all so much for hanging out with us tonight. Let's see where we're at for stream numbers. 865. 865 would put us fifth. Fifth best live stream on Pure Drilling Sports here. You guys are the best for hanging out with us tonight. When I end the stream, it's going to ask you if you want to redirect over to Thomas Fitzpatrick's channel. He's doing the Red Sox and the Angels game tonight, so go over and show him some support as well, and we'll see everybody. Uh, next game planned is Sunday, but make sure you have uh, alerts on just in case I do do uh, the game tomorrow. So send us over to Thomas. We'll do. All right, guys. See everybody next time.